All right, everybody, what's up? It's Decada. Today, I'm going to be showing you a team that is going to separate you from everybody else on the server. Okay? If you want to be alpha, you got to switch it up. You got to get away from the meta. This team alone is what's going to change the game for you. You're going to be able to, to farm an insane amount of resources, and nobody's even going to know. You're not going to run into anybody, especially this early in the game. Uh, nobody's going to contest you. And all you have to do is have a little bit of, of common sense to know when to fight and know when to run. Alright, so the team you're going to want to use is none other than the Dunk. These are literally the best in the game. So the team you want to use is the Dunk. It's the best, best underwater team in the game in my opinion. Only second to um, the Anglerfish because of the Pearls. But... If you want to become alpha on your server, you have to get these. You have to. And I'll, I'm going to show you why. I'm going to show you why. So, a couple things about the dunks. There's a 50% weight reduction on almost everything. You can hit all these rocks. And you're going to see, you're going to get massive amounts of stone and metal. That's from one hit right there. I just got 40 stone. Almost every rock is, is hittable. You you can harvest almost all these little rocks. These little rocks aren't really that amazing. Although you, you get a lot of stone from these ones. But it's not... It's these little ones that are going to give you the stone, not the metal. Now, the thing about the dunks is they can harvest every single thing in the ocean that is not silica pearls. Everything in the ocean that's not a silica pearl. And the good thing, as we're probably going to see right here, is how tanky these boys are. doesn't matter if it's an eel. It doesn't matter if it's a megalodon. It, it, it doesn't matter. These boys are going to tank them. And they're going to tank them hard. We're going to see right here. We're just going to continue to... to Yep. So, we just wiped out four things right there. Let's go ahead and look at the dunk's health. It lost 20 HP. 20 HP from that. Alright, let's get back to the farming, though. All these little coral bits are all harvestable. Oil rocks. Massive amount. That's probably the best thing for these dunks is, is getting the oil. So the only thing these, these can't get is the silica pearls. But they, you're not even bothered by anything else. You can just, you just keep going about your business and you tank whatever gets in your way. Oh my gosh. It's another water drop. Another plus about these boys. Oh my god, I'm not level 80. That is wild. Yeah. So that's level 45 meg. You're going to kill him about 4 or 5 hits. Man, that sucks. How am I not level 80? That's a big rip right there. Look at all the stone we're getting. You're getting stone and metal now. And you're literally going to tank everything that tries to hurt you.
You put a whole group of these boys on you. It does not matter. I don't think I've lost any HP at all. I lost damn. That's about it. And just so everybody knows, this is a one-time server. This is official. The turn radius is so bad on these boys. You just have to stop, basically. So a bunch of this coral is now uh, harvestable, and it's going to give you a bunch of stone. It's going to give you a bunch of metal. As you can see right here, we are just every one of these big rocks. You're gonna you're gonna get metal. You're gonna get stone. Now. This might, the stone method might not be, or the metal method might not be as fast as, let's say you're on an RG and um, an Anki. But when you're on an RG and Anki, at least on my server that I'm on right now, I'm seeing a lot of other tribes trying to contest us, trying to pick us off our teams, trying to kill our uh, Ankies and stuff. The amount of times that I've been doing this, I have not had one single person contest me. I'm just hitting these small little rocks. That's all That's all you have to do. There's not a single thing in the ocean that can kill you on one of these. Even if it's even if it's a low level, okay? Doesn't matter what what level dunk you get. All right. So after about 5-10 minutes of farming, this is what my inventory looks like. And the thing about it is I was not contested by a single person. This is literally five minutes. I went out and I got a oh, thousand stone with a 50% 50, 50 weight reduction on all of this. A couple hundred metal to go along with it. In my mind, there's no doubt that if you're trying to farm, there's there's no other team you, you want right now other than a dunk. So, I hope I helped you guys out today. Alright, just a recap of why I think the dunk is the best. Massive amounts of stone and metal underwater. You can't be contested. I mean, you can, but it's so rare for anybody to even want to contest you down there. Most, I'd say 98% of people in ARC don't want to go in the water. That's just a fact right there. Nobody wants to go in the water because they know there's people like me down there. And lastly, you get the 50% weight reduction on all items. 50%. No matter what it is, you get a 50% weight reduction. And I guess fourth, you could say you can do it solo. You don't need somebody on, a, on an RG to carry you and do it. So, for your little solo farmers out there that like to build in the uh, Pearl Caves, this is the team for you. I hope I helped you guys out in this video. Um, if you guys enjoyed watching it, leave a like and a comment.